Hello, what's up? Ali here. And on this video, we are going to show you how we can install HEN on our PS3 on the latest firmware, again, which is 4.91. But just a little disclosure before we proceed to the video that uh, as of uh, the time that we are making uh, this video, the official head installer for 4.91 from the official PS3 exploit team is not yet fully available yet. So um, if you are not yet or if you haven't updated your PS4 yet, I would strongly recommend uh, to just wait for the official web host before we can install or before we install our hand or cfw on our ps3 and you don't have to worry that uh, there is already a uh, ongoing works and testing for the latest cfw we'll just have to wait but in case you have accidentally updated your ps3 then you can go ahead and uh, follow this video to install hand using the alternate host from our russian team and just a little assurance uh, I have used their host uh, for a couple of years now because uh, there was some time that uh, the official host has to undergo some maintenance and there was also some uh, um, situation before where the official host was attacked and uh, they were not available for a couple of months. So I have to rely on our Russian team to install HEN on the PS3 and uh, so far I have never encountered any issues on every PS3 uh, that I have installed HEN. But then again, if uh, we can wait, let us go ahead and wait for the official uh, host from the official team. So let us go ahead on our video. I will first show you how we can download the hybrid firmware and install them on our PS3. First, let us go ahead and visit the official website of our Russian team. You will find the link on our description. Just open the link and it will take you to this website. You can use the translator of uh, your browser. Use English. Or you can simply follow this guide. On this website, you can find a guide on how to use uh, their website to install HEN. So just scroll down a little until you get to this part. Firmware 4.91.2 Hybrid Firmware. Just click on this part. Then click on Download. And you can find a source where to download the latest hybrid firmware. Let us go ahead and choose Google. Once you are here, just click on this icon, download, then download. Next is we'll have to prepare our thumb drive to use this hybrid firmware update and install it to our PS3. We will also try to address every possible issues you can encounter and provide you a fix so that you can safely update your PS3. So after you have downloaded the update file, you should have this. And the file name should be exactly ps3op.pup. First, you will have to make sure that the file name is exactly the same and it's all capitalized. Now, let us go ahead and prepare our USB or external hard drive. For this video, I'm going to use my old USB thumb drive and it has to be formatted to FAT32. Just right click on the drive, click on properties, and here on the file system, you should see here FAT32. If you're having some issues of formatting your hard drive to FAT32, I will just leave a link on our description for a video on how we can format our hard drive to FAT32 and also address all of the possible issues that we can encounter when formatting our hard drive to FAT32. Now, once we have prepared our hard drive or USB thumb drive, we'll just have to create a folder on the root and name it PS3, all capitalized. Now, inside the PS3 folder, create another folder and name it update again all capitalized now inside the update folder we are going to place our update file here now just for a quick recap the file name should be ps3 of that that pup it should be exactly the same then we'll have to create a folder on the root of our hard drive, name it PS3. And inside the PS3, create another folder and name it update, both capitalized. And inside the update folder, we are going to place our update file. Now, before we install this to our PS3, we have to make sure that our PS3 can detect the hard drive. If your PS3 can't detect the hard drive, that means that you have some issues with the hard drive itself. So before we fix any other issues, we have to make sure that our PS3 can detect the hard drive. 
on the PS3 after we inserted our USB or external hard drive, we can verify that our PS3 detects the hard drive if we can see the USB icon here on the video, music, or photos. If you don't see your USB icon here, means that your PS3 could not detect your hard drive. Before you try to fix anything, you have to address this issue first. First, you'll have to check if the USB has the right format, which is FAT32. If you can verify that it's on FAT32 and still you cannot find the USB icon here, try to use it on a different USB port. If you can assure that the USB port has no problem, then most of the time, the issue is within the hard drive. Please go ahead and check the video that we will share on our description. It covers every possible solution for every possible issues that we can have on our hard drive when updating our PS3. And now if the PS3 can detect the hard drive but can't detect the update file, that's when you check if the update file has the right file name or it is saved in the right directory. Make sure that the file name is exactly the same and it's saved inside the update folder, inside the PS3 folder, all capitalized. And to update, just go to the system update and update via storage media. After the update, just go to the browser and prepare for the hand installation. On the browser, press triangle, then go to tools, confirm browser set to off, then back to tools again, home page, use blank, then OK, then back to tools and delete everything that you can delete. Then leave and re-enter your browser. Then on your browser, just press start and enter this following address. This will automatically install HEN on your PS3 using alternate host. You'll just have to wait for the initialization to complete and it will automatically install all of the required files and PKGs in your PS3. After the installation, your PS3 will restart and that will complete the installation. You can just go ahead and enable your HEN as usual. But like we have mentioned earlier, it is still advisable to just wait for our official PS3 exploit team to release their HEN installer. But if you have already updated your PS3, you can still follow this video and safely install HEN on your PS3. And as soon as our official HEN installer is up, I'll go ahead and update all of the links on our descriptions and you can still follow our old videos on how to install HEN. The process will still be the same. So this will be it for now. If you have any questions or suggestions, please go ahead and share them on our comment section and I will definitely address them. And again, my name is Ali. If you find this video helpful, please go ahead and like and subscribe. And I will definitely see you on our next video. Bye-bye.